Okay, so let's take a look at this problem. You're asked to figure out the net force that is acting on this object on an incline. And you're also told it's frictionless. So what, are you, what does that mean? That means the force of friction, right? There is no force of friction that's going to hold it there. And, of course, it's going to go ahead and it's going to slide down the incline. Well, where is that force that's pulling it down the incline coming from? Well, it's, of course, coming from the object's own weight, or its FG. But not its total weight. I'm not just dropping it, right? It's moving down the incline. Well, look at these two equations that we have here. We have F parallel and F perpendicular. FG, or the weight of the object, is always going towards the center of the earth or straight down but we can go ahead and we can break this up once again into these components F parallel and F perpendicular and meaning perpendicular by the way to the surface so that's here that's F perpendicular and then of course we have F parallel which is only a portion of the object's weight so there's some, of course, that is equal in magnitude to the normal force of the object, and then some of its weight that's pulling it down, which, of course, is F parallel. All right, so what the heck am I trying to say here? What I'm trying to say, in order to calculate the force, which is the net force acting on this object, because we're saying it's frictionless, so FF, which would be opposing motion, is zero, is to use the F parallel equation. So from here, once you figure that out, what is F parallel? F parallel is, of course, mg, which is the mass of the object, the 10 kilograms, times 9.81 meters per second squared. And I need the sine of 30 degrees. Of course, what do I have? The sine of 30 degrees is 0.5. And I have 0.5 times 10, which of course is 5, and then 5 times 9.8, essentially we get 49. And of course the units here are newtons. So 49 newtons, not only is it F parallel, but in this case F parallel is equal to F net. Okay, keep working hard, check out more videos, and good luck.